A deep love and reverence for what the Bible teaches about Christian unity is the heartbeat of the Be United in Christ Outreach Ministry. Genuine, visible love and unity among God's children proclaims His gospel to the world. To help you understand our Lord's desire for His people to be united in Christ, we have developed many resources on the subject of Christian unity. We have separated these Bible-based resources into two categories, basic resources and our premium collection of books. Our basic resources are available to you at no cost for download and online viewing. These resources contain helpful Bible passages and wise counsel from some of the most respected theologians, pastors, and Bible scholars in church history, like John Owen, Martin Luther, Irenaeus, Matthew Henry, and more. Our premium collection contains some of the greatest books ever written on the subject of Christian unity. This collection includes books written to help you better understand Scripture's three great love commandments, the power of God's grace, and Christ's passion for the unity of His people. Our premium collection is available for purchase as audiobooks, ebooks, and print books. Our basic resources and our premium collection of books can be found at BeUnitedInChrist.com. Our resources contain thousands of Bible passages on the subject of Christian unity. Here's a sampling for you to consider. Behold how good and how pleasant it is for brothers to dwell together in unity. Psalm 133, 1. For just as we have many members in one body, and all the members do not have the same function, so we, who are many, are one body in Christ, and individually members one of another. Romans 12, 4 through 5. Finally, all of you should be of one mind, sympathize with each other, love each other as brothers and sisters, be tender-hearted, and keep a humble attitude. 1 Peter 3, 8. If someone has enough money to live well and sees a brother or sister in need but shows no compassion, how can God's love be in that person? 1 John 3, 17. We know what real love is because Jesus gave up his life for us. So we also ought to give up our lives for our brothers and sisters. 1 John 3, 16. A new commandment I give to you that you love one another, as I have loved you, that you also love one another. John 13, 34. Those who love God must also love their fellow believers. 1 John 4, 21. As we read the Bible, it becomes clear that unity among God's people is an act of obedience to God and an act of love to your Christian brothers and sisters. We encourage you to join in our mission Visit our website, explore our resources, watch our videos, and download our executive summary. Together, we will inspire and encourage other believers to be united in Christ.